You ready to fight? You ready? Well, Sean O'Malley has been a notorious fast starter in the UFC thus far. It is something his corner has prioritized once again here tonight. Let's see if O'Malley can lead the dance and dictate the pace here. All right, good start for the Sugar Show. Sean O'Malley realizing particular success with that left hand. Yeah, he's got a great left hand. He's so long for the weight that he pops the jab and he just darts him with the left hand. And you see it on full display right now. Able to land to the body there with the left kick. Swing and a miss. Five draw. Nice spinning attack to the body. Lands for him. Oh, man. Both of these guys didn't really take a shot. Keep pushing. Oh, he blasted the kick to the midsection right there. Got it right below that elbow guard. And on the other side, if you're the boxer, maybe need to lower that guard a little bit more. Well, you're at kicking range and not boxing range. So as he's landing damage, the boxer can't reach him with the punches. It's beautiful, and it shows how hard they work in building this game plan and this approach that has allowed for them to jump out in front. Oh! Superman punch lands! Oh, good block there. Oh, big left hand. We'll see if he can follow it up. Nice. When he gets close, he throws, he lands. Lands a shot to the leg. Get yeah. another nice leg kick here by O'Malley. They're so evenly matched, they're going tit for tat. Two minutes to go in round one. Let's go, more, 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 that's working. Doing a real nice job with these leg kicks, trying to slow his opponent down, and largely succeeding. Pretty good, but didn't sort of smell blood in the water. And now his opponent's back in. I mean, blood's in the water. You gotta go and get it. You gotta go find the finish. You cannot let him off the hook like that because now he will be motivated to try to go and hurt you as you hurt him. O'Malley's swelling now around that jaw area. We'll see if he can make some adjustments and perhaps defensively raise that guard to prevent any further damage. Final seconds here. An elbow! We don't see that oh, much. That was the horn at the end of the round. Thankfully for him, he will live to see another round. You saw him get All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. We had a knockdown there, but not a knockout. No, it wasn't a knockout, but you can't take those shots. That big punch landed, and it sat him down. If he gets hit with another one of those, it might be good night, Irene. You ready to fight? You ready? Let's All right, second round underway. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Nice block. Punch went nowhere. Trading huge shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. High level at strike lands there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Oh, my goodness. All right, so we can see some swelling on the facial region now as his opponent lands yet another strike, and that one was clean. I mean, this guy is so clean. He gets to the flying knee. Garbrandt's able to switch his stance here. We'll see how the defense responds. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Five knockouts.
Bruce Buffer now with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 42 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Cody No Love Crowd. Well, this is a man who can truly do it all inside that octagon, and he proved that yet again here tonight. Congratulations to the former UFC Bantamweight champion, Cody Garbrandt. No longer undefeated, but still on his best night. Looks the part of one of the best 135ers in the world. And don't be surprised to see him at the post-fight press conference call for an immediate title shot. He certainly did everything in his power to earn that here tonight.